Okay, so let's talk about the grip on the pistol for just a second. The grip that we're going to look to build is going to be taking the, uh, the thumb and getting as high as possible off the, the, the area here. I want my bird finger to touch underneath the trigger guard and I'm seating the tang back of the back strap of the gun. My hand is as high up in the back strap as I possibly can get it. This hand's going to come up underneath and I'm going to take the drumstick, this part of the hand, and I'm going to grind that in and fill up that gap, fill up that spot there. And it's almost like I'm trying to arm bar myself, just torquing that thumb. This thumb ought to be pointing in the direction that I want to fire. Points of performance are, if this is a, uh, a horizontal line, my hands, my fingers of my support hand should form 45 degree angle this way in relation to the barrel going or the muzzle going this way. So that's one way I can check to see if my hand is in the proper orientation like this. The other way you can do it is you turn the gun up, look at the top of it, and if your thumb and your, four, your firing finger are uh, parallel to one another here, you know that, that that thumb, that hand is far enough forward. If it's not, if it's back here, then you don't have, this relationship is not gonna be right, and you don't have as much control over the pistol as possible. The other piece of it is back here, you wanna fill up all of this void, like you're trying to press the gun out with your hands pressing the pistol out so here's why we do that if i take this pistol what's going on is an explosion inside the inside the chamber if i fire this pistol with this just one hand it's probably going to go a certain direction because i'm giving it pressure on one side so if i fire here we're looking for it to go off to the left with my other hand it's going to do the same thing it's going to go the opposite direction Come straight back. That gives us the ability then to control the recoil of the pistol no matter what. Now, if you want to fire one-handed, what I like, what I like to do is try to take one arm and brace it off my chest, drive the pistol out, and that gives me a little bit of a turn. And that thumb is still going to go up, just like I would put a thumb, a hand in here. But I'm going to put that thumb out to the side, and that gives me. So that's just a little piece on the grip.